Gary Goldsmith, C Carol Mil Middleton's younger brother, is set to release a tell-all book to set the record straight after accusations and criticisms by Harry and Meghan. Bombshell warning. And this guy, now I'm going to talk about this guy briefly. Uh, uh, Catherine's uncle will set the record straight in his own tell-all by addressing Prince Harry's spare accusations. Mm, I, I don't know. I have my doubts that this is going to happen. But let's read on. Uh, he's releasing his own tell-all, the sausage attempt to paint the Princess of Wales as rigid and unaccepting of her American sister-in-law. But Goldsmith can highlight a different perspective of the royal family drama. When Prince Harry was originally compiling his book, his publisher was confident Prince William wouldn't comment. That, that is, a, that is a, like a strategy of war. They, they knew that William was not going to make any comment about spare, but because it wouldn't be fitting for a future king to do so, the insider told an outlet. But what if, what if Uncle Gary, Uncle Gary speaks? I, I don't know. This is my point of view. I think that uh, having um, uh, gone through Uncle Gary's history, of, you know, he he was, uh, I think he was convicted or something for for hitting his ex-wife with a left hook. Oh, no, Uncle Gary, we don't, do not do that here. That is, that is absolutely out of the question. You are, you, you are not some, someone to be trusted. Just by that, that you were drunk, that Uncle Gary was drunk and he just hit his ex-wife with a left hook. Uh, and drew her to the ground. No, 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 no. You, you, you're making Harry look good with that kind of thing. So that's why I think any tell-all by Uncle Gary would um, would do more harm that go than good for Catherine. That, that's my point of view. I don't know what you think about this. I don't think about this. Uncle Gary won't write a book. That is another thing that I was thinking because he is so busy with his, uh, 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 it's like this uh, hiring, right? Uh, it's a company that's focused on hiring. Maybe I was thinking of this. What do you think about this? I want to ask you this, my rogues. I found Uncle Gary on LinkedIn. I found Uncle Gary on LinkedIn. You know, this professional network when you can connect with people for professional stuff. Maybe I could I could uh, connect with Uncle Gary. Should I connect with Uncle Gary on LinkedIn? So I maybe uh, I could give some body language curses to for his company. That would be fun. That that, that besides the hitting women thing, uh, besides that, which is a a, a deal breaker for me. In fact, uh, I, I I would not like to hang out with people like that. Uh, the guy looks interesting, but uh, no. But maybe I could, maybe I could, I, I could reach out on link, in LinkedIn. All right. <laughs> okay. Some of you should I? I'm going to post a poll, a quick poll here on uh, on YouTube. Should I connect with Uncle Gary on LinkedIn? Please be honest. <laughs> should, should could that be a good idea or not? Oh my god. Ah, uh, oh my god. But no, that 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 event, that event. So much to talk about. And we have to mention this. We have to mention this as well. Because you know that the Harkles have all this kind of stuff going on. And it's not like, oh Jesus, why do you keep mentioning that? It's because the media keeps mentioning them. And the Royal Rogue is here to try to debunk whatever is out there. It's, 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 that, it's that easy. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle said to break royal tradition. No shit. <laughs> I had to say that. I'm sorry. I tried to keep this family friendly. But yet another royal tradition to break with plan for children. The royal tradition that they're going to break is that there's a tradition that every royal couple must have 
free children. Wh wh who writes these kind of things? Yes, this is from the Daily Abscess. Uh, it, it's, uh, it's like a, a royal tradition that uh, royal couples must have three children. And Harry and Meghan said no, because, you know, the ozone layer or some kind of environmental hi hypocritical uh, statement. You, you know how they are in that regard. All oh, the uh, climate change and stuff. But let me board my uh, sixth or seventh or eighth uh, private jet, uh, private jet uh, trip in this month. You know how they are. Oh, my God. You, you really want me to connect with Uncle Gary? 57%. I will. I will connect with Uncle Gary on LinkedIn and I will let, let's wait until we have at least 500 votes and then I will tell you. So that is the royal tradition. You think that they will be at some point expecting a third one to break that to keep the tradition in this case? I don't know. And by the way, just to I, I don't want to I don't want to go that hard on Harry, but Prince Harry admitted he seems to fit Matthew Perry's character Chandler in France. And to be fair, this was not after uh, the tragic demise of, uh, of Matthew Perry. This was on Spare. It wasn't in the book Spare. But you tell me. And you tell me that Gingerbread. And you tell me that Gingerbread has, has gotten into so much trouble. Do you really? Think that Harry, you know Vegas Harry, you know SS Harry, you know um, Naked Poker Harry, you know that uh, well all that all that stuff Harry, you know that um, um, girl th throwing girl girls into a pool Harry. Does that sound like Chandler to you? No, right. Oh, he wanted to come out as interesting. No, Harry. No, 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 no. You're not it. You, Harry, you are the kind of guy. You are the kind of guy that people like Chandler or myself will look at you at high school and say, I I'm going to I'm going to prank you real bad one of these days. I'm going to prank you real bad. You you were the you, you, that, that was the kind of guy. No, no, no. This just doesn't fit. And this is not because Matthew Perry passed away. He already said that on Spare. I didn't uh, catch up that back then. But right now, I'm telling you that really doesn't, doesn't make sense. No, and Harry, you're not fun like uh, Joy or silly. Like you're silly in other ways, but not silly as Joy. And no, you're not a nerd or a geek as Ross. No, you, you, you shouldn't be a Virgo. We, we should excommunicate you, Harry, from the, the Virgo sun sign. That, that's something that I, I should have a motion for that. Okay, 60% after 300 votes, 60% want me to uh, connect with Uncle Gary. I'm going to look for Uncle Gary right here. Uh, I'm going to look for him right here, and I'm going to let's, let's wait for 500 votes. Let's wait for 500 votes, and I will and I will screenshot the proof that I connect. I requested to connect with Uncle Gary to see what happens.